Hey y'all, APG Jamie here, and today we're making a uh, new little journal because I wanted to put some, do some postage stamps. I think it was uh, Belle that did this uh, some years ago. I'm not sure y'all who it was. I will try to find the video and link to it, and I told her that one day um, I was going to do it, and I finally did it because somebody sent me a big old envelope, not a big old envelope, a regular letter size envelope uh, with some postage stamps in there, and I thought, oh, this is the perfect time to make that uh, journal I talked about a few years ago, forever ago, it could have been 20 years ago, no, it wasn't 20 years. So anyway, we're using this, uh, this is a legal size folder, and it's like ones they use at doctor's offices or, you know, that kind of thing where it's got the uh, the echo, echo, that is the, those metal doohickeys. That's what those are. Those are echo brides. And uh, it's really nice. I got it from the Angelic Rese Resale Store, y'all. It's a charity shop here. And um, they had a bunch of them, and I only bought one stack. And I, I'm kind of thinking, you know, you might have should have brought a couple stacks, but... So it goes, and they're brand new. They're, they weren't even experienced folders. So uh, we're just going to, uh, I've already had some uh, watercolor paper that was cut down to that size, and I'm like, okay, we'll do that. And so we're making the folder to go on to um, the paper that's already cut. So uh, the paper, once it's folded in half into a signature, will be uh, each piece will be a four by four square which is like wow so uh i'm making the journal to fit that and uh well you know the folder's the cover <laughs> anyways um i'm doing all this stuff because i'm like oh yeah and this could wrap around here and this could wrap around there and y'all sometimes i just don't even know what to think about me i just don't i'm measuring the spine and then I'm going to eyeball it, sort of. <laughs> it's a heavy folder, y'all. And that gusset that's in there, you know, so that the folder can expand. Um, I don't know that it's Tyvek-type material, but it is a uh, Tyvek-type material. <laughs> I don't know that it's Tyvek. Anyway, it's really nice. So I did not reinforce that at all. Um so I'm just making some score marks and, um, you know, it's really hard to score because it's it's pretty heavy folder, y'all. And using the bone folder, it's not a real bone, people. So I'm like, yeah, that's going to fold up and then, wait, what? What am I, what? I'll tell you what, it's too long, so I gotta cut that down to four inches so that it's uh, four. Because the signatures are, and I'm like, I don't know, I don't even know how to cut anymore. Don't even know how to use a cutter. And my blade is so dull, y'all. I have spare blades, um, but, you know, that would require me to change it. Now, I'm going to go ahead and. Uh, do this little spoiler thing the whole segment the whole segment where I pamphlet stitched the signatures in didn't get recorded it was one of those cases now I hadn't done this in a year or better okay it's been a real long time since I did this I thought I was recording but I wasn't I did that opposite stop start recording thing. Y'all know, well, if you made videos, you'd know what I'm talking about. But because this was so cute, I'm like, I'm going to show them anyway. Because we do, we do a little uh, stamp page. We saw that when you saw the um, thumbnail, which is what attracted you to this video to begin with, right? Or maybe you just love watching me because I'm just so stinking fun and never know what I'm going to say. Guy, okay? or kind of do even. So uh, we decided we was going to round the corners. Now we're not to our missing part yet because I'm like, okay, yeah, that's going to, okay. Let's just go ahead and round them all. Why just round two of them? 
and then we're going to round the paper and it is a watercolor paper it's um i wouldn't call it heavyweight and i darn sure wouldn't call it lightweight so it's medium weight y'all so we rounded all our papers and um how many do i have i i don't know five or six i don't know now I used what i had five or six going to show you uh, scoring all of them. This is a short video, y'all. It's less than 15 minutes. Can you believe it? It would have been probably 20 minutes if I hadn't have unrecord, not recorded, not recorded because I didn't record the signature part. And it was the best sewing in I had ever done. Y'all, it was just a three-hole pamphlet stitch. I made the little template and everything. I mean, it's, I was so disappointed when I went to edit this a while ago. And it's like, and this is me looking at it. I'm like, yeah, that looks good. I like that. See? Ta-da! Magic of YouTube. Lost footage. Not lost footage. Didn't even stink and record it. So this is the part I didn't know uh, I was recording. I thought I had hit stopped recording. So I was fumbling around looking at the stands. I'm like, yeah, we'll use this one. And I went around the studio gathering up. Oh, this would be good. This is fine. Yes, this is fine. And then I had a couple things was on my desk. And I'm like, yeah, this is fine. And I picked uh, this color, although you probably can't even tell it's a color y'all it's such a extremely pale green and i watered it down on the page because i spritzed the page with uh water and y'all know i keep distilled water in my spritz bottles and now i'm just dobbling it around kind of you know just dobbling it y'all uh it doesn't even look like any color at all on my screen it just all looks the same white blow it blow it out white as a matter of fact <laughs> You want to get technical about it. I'm just dobbling it up now with the uh, damp baby wipe was almost dry. Hey, can y'all almost dry uh, baby wipe that was just laying there because it was just laying there. <laughs> I used it earlier in the day. Anyway, so we're just fumbling around. And I thought, let's use some corget. And I tore it off and a little bitty piece tore off. And I'm like, well, dang it, Dale, I need some more. So pulled off some more i'm like it's fine it's fine this is a fun mindless little postage stamp journal that's the only thing that, that i plan on going in here is postage stamps okay and i'm like oh look at this pretty little thing it's been wadded up in a little tiny baggie <laughs> Okay, but I'm like, oh, let's use some of this fibers because it's got fibers in it. And I'm like, no, that's the wrong color. Oh, look at this string. I don't know what that was off of. And I thought, yep, we're going to use it. Oh, uh, y'all. I could have called it a trash page, but it's not trash. It's treasure. And I'm like, yeah, okay. So now let's just take that off and glue it. Are we going to ink? Or are we going to ink? What color are we going to ink with? Black. Ah. Uh, I know I could have used a way more colorful stamp because I had way more colorful stamps in in the envelope. I have a little, uh, you know, them little plastic uh, drawer doohickeys. The three of them, you know, they're little. They're like, what is it? It's probably like a, a six by nine or something drawer thing. Uh, anyway, I've had it forever. And I've got experienced stamps in there. Because these are experienced stamps. Although some of them look like they're probably new. Like they just never got used. And of course, we don't use that value stamps anymore. Now we have forever stamps. And if you're smart, you bought a bunch of them back when they were still in the 40 cents. But they're not 40 cents anymore. Now they're in the 50 cents. And depending on what uh, year you watch the video, because it's 2020 now, and I think stamps is like 55 cents a piece. Of course, we got some odd uh, price. Oh, he can, y'all. Yeah. Some more odd price stamps. Anyways, it could be a dollar a stamp now. I don't know. Post office may not even exist anymore. What? So anyway, that was matte medium. I used matte medium because that law that paper, that scrapbook scrap that I picked up is just regular. Uh, actually, it's kind of thin, y'all. Yeah, it's probably copy weight paper. Anyway, I thought I like it. 
I like it because I kept it. Because I like it and I keep using it and all kinds of stuff, y'all. I've got two or three strips over there still. Or maybe it's just now one. I don't know. So we're going to use my favorite glue to glue the stamp on. This is an experience stamp, so it has envelopes stuck on the back of it. Not a lot, you can't see it, but anyways. So now we're just going to glue down our corrugate with my favorite glues. Mm -hmm. We're just smooshing it down. And I wanted to keep this, you know, my whole idea was, well, this is going to be have stamps in it, so everything, every page is just going to be real flat. <laughs> Who am I kidding, y'all? Who am I kidding? kidding oh goodness gracious oh with that little um that little feather right there was in that little baggie with that piece of twisted up uh trim whatever that is there was all kinds of i mean it's little baggy one of them little jewelry bags i had this stuff just shoved in there and to tell you the truth i just shoved all that stuff right back in that little baggie so i've got a line of glue there and we're going to glue this on this is kind of this kind of a plasticky kind of trim y'all it's not really plastic but i don't know it's weird and and it won't lay straight and i gotta get some clamps and i gotta unclamp the paper that's you know protecting the other pages and hopefully i don't make every page all bulky like i've been doing the last couple weeks few months um because then I'll have too many signatures in there. And I just have three. Oh, it must be six pages then. <laughs> Two pages each. So that's enough for 12 stampage. I'm just straightening out that. I thought I was done. And I took some pictures. So when you see the photo montage, there'll be some with them without words. Okay? And I thought, nope, this that blank piece of paper needs some words on it. And I thought, let's find some words. Okay, let's use this right here. And I think it says substance of uh, conscience. Okay, I'm, I'm just, I don't even know now. Don't know. It was five minutes ago I finished filming. I don't know. It wasn't five minutes ago. But I sure like this little first page we did in the stamp journal. And I hope we see this journal again. So... That's just pretty much going to wrap it up, y'all. I lost my sewing in the signature footage. Three whole pamphlet stitch. Best, best one I ever got sewed in. Uh, 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 uh. Are you ready? Are you ready? Photo montage. <laughs> so some of the pictures were inside. Some of the pictures were outside. See, look at this string. This stuff there the sewing <laughs> bless my heart y'all I appreciate each and every one of you your kind comments your likes your subscriptions and if you've not done so I would like to invite you at this time to subscribe click the bell for notifications if you would like notifications if your accounts at YouTube is set up that way thanks for watching and happy art y'all